Uh, it was really good. I mean, obviously that was a tough loss. That one uh, hurt Sting, all of the above. Uh, but again, just the last week or so, you know, after our streak, trying to find it back again. So it was good to get a win uh, tonight. You may said post game second half of the season, you felt like you guys started not respecting your opponents too much, starting you know taking some real pride in that respect. Do you feel a trend in that direction too as the season carried along? Yeah, I mean, I think you know we started this season knowing that it was going to take a little time. Uh, there were going to be some growing pains. There were going to be some ups and downs. And when you're in the middle of it, it's hard to, to remember that. Um, but as you take a step back, you can you know kind of see where the ebbs and flows of the season were. And, uh, I thought since the All Star break, I like a lot of the ways that we were playing. We didn't really have too many letdowns, maybe other than the Golden State game. Uh, New Orleans was tough coming right out of the break. But other than those two, I, I liked our, our spirit of effort, you know, collectiveness, most nice. It was important to show that one last time in this program. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we've been, I don't know what, fifth or sixth best team in the West on, at home this year. Uh, pretty pretty good at home, can be better, especially the ones we gave away. We can count on hands how many of those we gave away um, here at, at home. But uh, the fans that's showing up, that's coming here supporting us, you know, it's always good to try to go out there and put a show on and um, get wins for the fans. Do you think performing well against a team that still has a lot to play for can maybe help? build momentum for the end of the season and maybe even for next year? Yeah, I think at this point, we're just trying to play good basketball, get better each day. Uh, they kicked our butts first game of the season. We would definitely remember that. So it was good to get some get back there. Um, but again, trying to close out strong here. From your uh, on-court performance to the leadership, um, do you feel this game is the perfect testament of what you meant to this team all season? Uh, I don't know. I, I'm not really too crazy about summarizing my own importance. Um, I'll let you guys do that. But uh, just try to be here, uh, be accountable, uh, be a leader every day, and um, you know try to help these guys grow. And I feel like we've done that this year, but we got a long way to go. You kind of knew the talent that was on the roster when you signed here. Is there anything that you've learned about this group, though? I just love the fight. I love the, the competitive spirit. Uh, we got a lot to, to work with. Uh, we got a lot of growing to do still, but we got a lot to work with. There's a lot of promise, and um, I've, I've loved our togetherness and, and just the camaraderie of everybody wanting to win. Given but, another season to grow together, what do you think this team can accomplish next year? Uh, well, we need to be thinking about making a deep run. You know what I mean? I set our set our aim high, and um, you know, don't take no for an answer. So we got we got a lot of work to do though. Yeah, I mean, he's he's been one of our best shooters all year, uh, finding his spots and being able to shoot, being able to, to get to the one, two dribble pull ups, uh, stretch it out to three. Um, he's, he's been steady for us all year shooting the basketball, and tonight he was incredible for us, uh, just knocking down shots, you know, start to finish. Can you speak at all about the culture that he made has created here? It seems like he really helped set the tone for this yeah, I mean, I think, you know, proof is in the pudding. You guys, you know, that were here covering the team last year versus covering the team this year, I think you can see the difference. It's not uh, too hard. Um, you can just, it's, it's, it's visible, first and foremost. And then, it's, you know, behind closed doors on a day-to-day -day basis, the atmosphere, coming to work every day, um, being accountable, getting better, and uh, really just being no nonsense and, and being about business. I think, you know, that sets the blueprint um, for, for a lot of young guys to be able to grow. You may say he doesn't mind the chippiness uh, with this team. How much do you feel like you guys have to kind of grow in the area as far as toughness or just grittiness uh, when you first got here to where you guard guys are? A lot. We have to grow a lot, and you have to learn what it takes to win. And I think as a young player, you think it's all of this flashy, um, flamboyant things and miraculous things that you have to do to win. But sometimes you got to fight. Sometimes you just got to, uh, you know, be words that I can't say here. You know what I mean? You got to be tough, and you, you got to have some – some, some fight to you, um, and most nice is who wants it more, and who's going to execute, who's going to fight harder, who's going to get the loose balls, and I think that uh, we're growing in that regard for sure. Thank you.